First, tracking holiday deliveries. It's important with porch pirates on the prowl. Many companies offer real-time tracking updates, but scammers out there are looking to take advantage of that as well. Good evening, I'm Pam Huff. And I'm Muriel Bailey. With Christmas a week away, many of you may be expecting last minute packages. ABC 3340's Erin Wise is working for you tonight. And Erin, people should be cautious of those fake delivery notices this week. Bureau of Central and South Alabama says this week is one of their biggest weeks when it comes to scams. For delivery scams, the big issue is with notices that come through text. This was a text I recently received regarding a package. It claims to be from the United States Postal Service, but the sender and link inside the text are suspicious. I showed the message to Coral Bates with the Better Business Bureau of Central and South Alabama. When you look at this, what are some signs that you see that are wrong? Well, right off the bat, that the fact that it's arrived at our warehouse and cannot be delivered due to incomplete address, that's that's completely false. This type of scam is called smishing. The people sending it are looking for personal and financial information. It's not necessarily bad right away, but a lot of the scammers are building a dossier on people. And so it's another piece of information that they can put together to maybe two months from now end up having enough information to steal your identity. The USPS confirmed the message was fake. The Postal Service has seen an increase of complaints from customers for similar messages. A public information officer with the Postal Service says these scams are in no way related to the USPS. The Postal Service will never text or email you for credit card information to retrieve a package from the post office or to deliver a package. Shipping services across the border being impersonated. Many of our viewers say they get the fake notices, some multiple times a week. One viewer says it bothers them because they order items frequently, saying they hold their breath and ignore them. Bates says the best way to verify shipping information is going straight to the websites of the retailer it was ordered from or the company that's delivering it. Know your confirmation or tracking number. It'll show you the, the line where your packages come from in the trail and it'll tell you if there's a problem then and that's safe to communicate through because you're using an actual shipper's website. Now, I also got this message from Amazon this week, and you can see it came from a five-digit code, and there's no suspicious link included, but I've not received text from them before. To be on the safe side, I verified with Amazon. It is a real text from the company through their notify of arrival feature for drivers. It's not an automated feature, meaning it's not sent every time, which could be why I've never seen it. You can find more information for major delivery companies regarding shipping notices on our website, abc3340.com.